Let's play here on Asus uh, ROG Allied the game um, Halo Infinite, the campaign mode. Here I have the game, and let's start um, and let's test every settings here available uh, with this game. You will have chapters as uh, usual, and I will um, use also the charger and uh, in this way uh, only on battery. Um, so uh, you will make an idea about this device. At this point. Um, I have the resolution scale 100%. This is what you can choose basically from uh, the, uh, to be basically to closer to this uh, this device. 100% at uh, 10 uh, 1280 by 800. Um, minimum frame rate uh, 30, maximum 120. Quality preset. Um, I have at this point the low profile selected. And I have to say at this point, I have the VRAM, that uh, video RAM memory um, selected on automatic mode for uh, this device. And it seems that we have the possibility to use um, eight gigabytes. At this moment with low settings, we get six gigabytes uh, selected automatically by, uh, by the device. So uh, let's see, uh, let's see, we get, um, We get 60 frames, it seems uh, 57. With low settings. At this point, um, let's connect the charger to make, to make an idea. And we have a uh, turbo mode with charger. And we get 73 frames. Nice. Let's go and uh, let's make some changes at this moment and let's choose medium graphics and let's see what happens here. Quality preset medium and this is what we get for medium settings. Let's check it again. So we have the medium uh, settings profile active. And let's see, we have 60 frames with medium graphics. Let's check it also on battery. There might be a way forward up above.
so on battery this is what we get 50 60 frames and uh, let's go at this point and let's choose high quality profile for uh, for this game and let's see how um, let's start with the charger to get the best of, uh, of it so let's choose here high quality profile for the game of course my advice is not to use uh, this kind of profiles I will advise you to customize the settings and to remove basically um, aspects like this one for example depth of field uh, volumetric cloud and fog and um, you you will get um, you will get a better experience anyway let's continue with high quality graphics and at this point the game looks phenomenal and without look upstairs, chief. Might be around to the bridge up there. Without these settings, if you use as I said your custom settings you can get even better. Anyway, um let's change here the resolution. This is not for our device. <laughs> okay, I uh, I don't know how to make at this point the window. To go to real full screen. Hey. 
this is crazy in a way I can't find the uh, Exit here. So with high quality graphics, you get uh, this kind of uh, frame rate. Let's go uh, and let's try at this point something else here. Let's see what we have. We have ultra quality, so let's try. Um, let's try this. So. Oh, no! Ultra quality, you get 47 frames. Fantastic. You know what, let's try at this, po uh, this point some custom high graphics and um, let's create them. Let's go here to settings. Let's choose high quality graphics and let's see what to what to keep here. Um, reflections, let's put them to medium. Depth of field, let's set it to low. Shadow quality to medium. Volumetric fog quality, let's turn it off. And cloud quality to low. Dynamic wind at medium. I don't know if we need this or not. So the number of birds, critters, let's set this to low, we don't need that one. And let's see what we get with these settings. Ninety-nine. 
we do not kneel before false idols. We stand. <laughs> Ships, an invasion force. How do we stand a chance against all this? The banished one already. We could be the only two humans left alive out here. Then there's still hope. 